Hello, so this is the first video on auditing brands and uh, well, luckily enough, I did not have to go hunting for one because I had one right in my DM. Today, I'm going to dissect it on a couple of fronts. Firstly, the messaging. Secondly, the outreach that they have done for it. And thirdly, the design and then a solution to it along with all of this. So now if you see, I received a message from a founder and I was more than happy to help because of course I love trying new SaaS tools. However, a big turn off for me was this. By the time I reached here, I was like, no, don't tell me that at least you've sent it with an AI. Of course, honesty is appreciated, but it can be a turn off. However, I wanted to give it a try and she sent me a free trial link. Now if you see, uh, with the free trial to send up to 1000 highly personalized messages with Drip and just click on this link and sign up for the trial. Again, they had this thing at the bottom. I don't think it was needed. Even if you did it for the first time, the second time it was not really needed. I'll come to this piece later on. So once I click on this link, this is where I reach. And I click on sign in. And since my Twitter account was already signed in I'm hoping that it gets I would have no idea why this is happening but never mind so this black background doesn't seem very appealing to me of course there's a demo video which is a good thing like it just helps you understand what and how to find your way around the product but I'm not able to so when I click on sign in, reload. So there seems to be some major glitch here and I have no idea why, but I have signed in with my Twitter, this, and then the third part was installing an extension. And as you can see here, I've already installed the extension and the next step was to go in and sign in. So now I do have access to my email ID and password but however yesterday when i was trying to sign in i did not and then did not have an option of resetting password right here so i had to reach out to the founders uh, again here i received an automated ai a big blow off ai message and then i reached out to the other founder and he said that he has shared the details with me over my email id for me to sign in again and that's how I do it. Now here when I'm clicking on this, this is again all black. I can't very clearly see the fields of where it's to be done because usually uh, you write email address as a message on the field so that you can just directly type in there. However, that was not the case here. They did not have the reset password option. In. And connect. Okay, well, so this is connected now finally. However, this I could do this because of course, because I had already installed the extension. However, today I'm not even able to sign in. So there is again a backend glitch here. So I personally feel that you should A, have ensured that your systems are up and working even in the beta phase because that's where your users get determined. And if I'm gonna face this much of glitches, I might as well not, you know, use it post the beta phase or even in the beta phase if there's a lot of back and forth and it creates a lot of friction for me so as a SaaS owner remember to remove as much friction as possible in the beta phase of your products and keep the users in mind while designing it if you're using a dark mode give them an option to switch to a normal mode all black looks cool but isn't exactly very cool thank you and i'll see you in the next video